morning guys, 19th of March, half nine. Let's go and see what we can find today. Come with us. Right guys, we've got a sink, an oven and a cooker top. Right, we've got a washing machine. Let's get it loaded. Right, there's the washing machine loaded. Thank you. Guys, I think it's time for the brew. Let's get the kettle on. Right, so we've got a barbecue, an old umbrella for a table, and can't take the telly. Let's get it loaded. Right, we've got a tin. Right guys, that kettle took half an hour to boil. But at least I've still got a hot brew. So we got a barbecue and just some other bits and bobs. Let's get it loaded. Frank guys. Right, the guy said he's got some more stuff there for me for tomorrow. It's uh, a barbecue, uh, one of them fire pit things, and an umbrella. So I've got to come back in the morning, guys. 
Right guys, I've just picked up a radiator. Um, it was out of another guy's van, so I didn't film it. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna go and get some dinner. Then I'm gonna go home, rejig this van. Um, I need more room. I've got a bit on, but not a lot of weight. So I'm gonna rejig it. Right guys, there's the van. Right about now. I'm gonna take it out and rejig it. Right, let's get cracking. What happens when you just throw it all in? You'd think I'd learn, but now I wouldn't. bits about it.
shoe. If I had more time, I would take the wiring loom out of it, but I haven't, so I'm not. the cooker top two microwaves that I want to keep so I can strip them that come off a fire it's got a bit of brass on it so I'm going to strip that still got a wire on it that microwave still got a wire on it I'll cut that later because they're staying here that washer's still got a motor on I'll get that off later when I go to Davidson's saves dragging it out to put it back in the hoover I'm saving because I'm going to do a strip down of that and see what's inside that <coughs> right now I suppose it's put it all back. Let's put it all back. Thank <laughs> you. 
can be me good fuck it. Thank you. 
another day I'm going to cut them wheels down and get them into what I went with that. Right, that's what the van looks like now. Now I've rejigged it. Gives me a bit more room. Not loads, just some. Let's go and see what else we can find. Right guys, the owner of this house has just told me to see if there's out here I want. Because the last tenants have smashed it up. So, we've got a wheelbarrow, we've got a little shovel, we've got some sheeting of metal. <laughs> Guys, all I took off that was uh, the wheelbarrow. Them sheets of metal was just covered in shite underneath. <clears throat> Davidson's wouldn't take them off me. So I've just left them, let the next guy get them. Right, we've got a cooker, an electric one. Just lay it down to take this wire out. Let's get it in. Right. Right, it's in. And now, I'm gonna go and empty. Let's go. Tell you what I've noticed with this phone, you knock the van slightly when it's recording and it cuts itself off. I don't know if all phones seem to do that, but this one does. Just got another microwave, guys, off the side of the road. I forgot to take the phone. Right, Chris, this bit is for you, mate. Uh, this is our, our lanes, our countryside, it's the only bit I know of around here anyway, so as you can see we're still on a housing estate. Still on the housing estate, and now I'm on the lanes. These are the only lanes and countryside that I know of around here. There could be more that I'm unaware of, but I don't think there is. do a left there you go to the airport Manchester Airport
right guys if you've seen what's in the back have a guess on the weight pause the video and guess the weight and then see how close you get to it I'm hopeless at guessing the way. I always think I've got less than what I've got, which is a good thing, because then I get more money than what I'm expecting. But you'd think I'd know by now, wouldn't you? What things are gonna be weighing. Right, Chris, and now we're coming back into civilization and into another housing estate. Right, guys, I'm here at Davidson's. <clears throat> There's two vans in front of me. Don't know how many's inside, I can't see. <laughs>
Right guys, I went in with 260 mixed steel at 165 pound a ton. I got 42 pound 90. I went in with batteries at 30 kilos at 450 pound a ton and I got 13 pound 50. So all in all, I got 56 pound 40. Right, it's half past three, so that's me done for the day. I'll see you all on the next one. So, half an hour.